An example of how the Control OR platform can start getting into the workflow and day-to-day -day processes of your operating room and even your perioperative areas uh, is the timeout period. Uh, if, if you've been in a surgery and you've noticed at the beginning of every surgery when the surgeon enters the room, they do a surgical timeout. And it's part of a quality measure to ensure that you're operating on the right person, everybody knows everybody else, and you're not going to uh, make any major medical mistakes with allergies and so forth. So this is an example of a timeout where we could literally bring the room to its knees until this is completed to ensure compliance for the staff. So this is a little bit long and it's very, very uh, simplistic, but you get the idea. Uh, you've identified the right patient, you've identified staff, do they have any allergies, do we have consent, um, and so on and so forth. And there's about 15 of these. And then the end, the staff gets a summary of their timeout and they can see if they have a successful yes is all the way across the board type of timeout. This is the most rudimentary uh, form of workflow that we do within Control OR. As you get a little bit more advanced, um, we, can we can put functionality in here such as staff notifications. Uh, if I wanted to put a single button right here that said I'm closing or closing has begun, I can push that button and have that do a multitude of things. I could have it tell the surgical uh, front desk that we're closing and they will know how far behind we are then automatically rather than having to place that phone call. If I wanted to notify a family pager that we're closing, surgery's done, um, uh, if I wanted to notify them to go to the consult room, I could do that. These, these single button workflows are adding one layer of complexity to the, to the interactive worksheet, but are still very powerful because you're, you're eliminating at least three or four or five phone calls or possibly pages that these staff members are doing for every single surgical case that they do. So as we continue to expand that product and, and our workflow engine becomes more and more robust, there will be workflow processes inherent within Control OR. Uh, you'll be able to follow a patient flow from the time that they show up till the time that they're transported back to ICU maybe or they're going home. Um, you fill in the blanks. That's the beauty of the flexibility of the workflow engine. So you can see that the workflow potential of the Control OR platform is not an intra-room workflow only. We can get outside the work outside into the perioperative space workflows, into notifications of physicians, patients, patient families. Uh, these are all untapped and very robust tools that are inherent within the software.